this is Ralph Goldheim from Focusrite Novation here at Sweetwater, and I'm very pleased to introduce the new Novation Base Station 2. This is the new pure analog synthesizer from Novation that's monophonic, and uh, I'm going to go through it for you. Master section, oscillators, mixer, filter section, LFOs, ADSR. These are the standard components of all synthesizers. As an analog monophonic synthesizer, it's very easy to control these. So if you were to go into a bass sound such as this, I'll take that sound apart for you so you can kind of get an idea of what's in it. Going to the mixer section, we have two oscillators. We have a second one here, which is, this is uh, pulse width, and a sub oscillator. That's where it gets its fat sound. Filter section is over here, and this has got two different types of filters. This is a classic filter and a new acid filter, which is, the only reason why it's called acid is it's uh, a diode ladder filter, the classic filter, which is this one, can be set at either 12 dB per octave or 24. It's a different type of sound, it has different harmonics to it. Personally, I'm a 24 dB guy. Then we go from the filter section into the ADSR, attack, decay, sustain, release. And this is where the the soft hit happens, or if we want the filter to come in slowly, or for it to last longer. So as you can see, you can take a sound and you can shape it very, very easily. Uh, as far as oscillators go, I'll go to a initial patch something like that, and I can show you that with the oscillators off. And we'll talk to oscillator 1, 16, 8 foot, 4 foot, 2 foot. So you can actually build the sound from the components. We'll start off with a sawtooth wave here. And then we'll go to oscillator 2. Oscillator 2 will make a square wave. And this is pulse width modulation. This is actually where a square wave is being pulled apart. The harmonics change dramatically. So we take the two oscillators, uh, 8 and 16 foot, and we add a sub oscillator. And now we're going to go to the filter section. Add the resonance because we like that. classic synthesizer type sounds with uh, resonance and filter. Uh, new features that are in this uh, include the latch and the arpeggiator. So that's not a bad sound. I like that. So let's use that. Okay. Uh, we'll do one. We can do octaves, triples, so that's the arpeggiator and the latch which holds the note. Now I can actually go into a record mode which would allow me to do step sequencing. So if I want to take this sound.
and then play it. This feature is incredibly useful for a synthesizer. So, that's your arpeggiator latch, uh, oscillators, uh, mixer section, filter, ADSR, and there's also analog effects. Like what? Well, uh, like distortion. Without it, oscillator filter modulation. This is like an FM sound. It takes the oscillators and works them against each other. There's a full range of sounds in it. They're not all bass. But let's just go back to some of the bass sounds that we've just put in here. Oh, that's right. It does lead sounds, too. It's one of my favorite uh, pulse width sounds. I've also got one in here that's got the latch and the arpeggiator on it. Now, this also has an external filter in, which you can take an external uh, audio source and put it through the filter section, which is very extensive. Um, it has full MIDI and out, in and out, uh, powered by USB or from an external power supply. This is a pure analog synthesizer that also can store your programs. So if you spent four or five hours working on the perfect sound and you don't want to lose it, this will store that sound. It also has a professional uh, synth keyboard and it's got aftertouch to it. I'm going to go through some patches now and you can get a taste on what it actually sounds like. This is a lead sound. Flute sound. This patch has this the latch arpeggiator already in. This is a quick look at the Novation Base Station 2, and for more information, please check with your Sweetwater sales engineer. This is Ralph Goldheim from Focusrite Novation.